If you're looking for the best white base lures here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on their features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers and customer feedback. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So let's get started. At the 10th position of our list, we have Mr. Crappy Jig. The Strike King Mr. Crappy Jig takes our final spot. This is a basic 1 8 ounce white jig head. It has painted eyes and a sharp number 2 hook. There is nothing too fancy about this option, but it can be effective when fished properly. Tip this with a small grub and work it with a slow to medium speed retrieval to try and get the fish to bite. Moving on to the next at number 9 with Booyah Super Shad. Number 9 on our list belongs to the Booyah Bladebait Spinner Fishing Lure. These lures are available in 5 color options and 2 size options, 3 16 ounce or 3 8 ounce. Each lure has a blend of colors that are made to resemble a school of baitfish. The colors of the 55 strand skirts are also made to resemble baitfish coming in options that resemble shad and shiner. These work great when the white base are actively feeding. Toss them near schools of baitfish near the surface and you're sure to get some action. The number 8 position is held by Fianto White Grub Tail, 2.6 inch worm swimbaits, soft plastic base lure. The next spot on our list goes to the Fianto Soft Plastic Curly Tail Swimbait. These lures are available in 21 different color options and measure approximately 2.6. In each pack, you get 20 small plastic swim baits. These are designed to feel and taste like real worms so the fish will not spit it out after biting. They are made with a powerful fish attracting scent. Try them on a drop shot rig when fishing white bass. Next at number 7 we have Bomber Lures Fat Free Shad Crankbait Base Fishing Lure. The next spot on our list goes to the Bomber Shad Crankbait Fishing Lure. These lures are available in 20 different color options and 5 different size options, which means you can find the perfect size for the white base in your area. These are made to dive fast and deep while its wobble motion and rattle send a signal out to all the hungry fish in the water. You can use this lure very productively when the white base are holding in deeper waters. The number 6 position is held by Strike King Sexy Spoon. The 6 spots on our list belong to the Strike King Spoon lures. These lures are available in five different color options, all of which are made to resemble dying baitfish. This one measures about four long and is designed to flutter and flash to emulate shad, which white bass are known to feed on. If you're fishing for white bass and you cast this lure near schools of shad, you will be sure to get the attention of the fish. The number five position is dominated by Umbrella Rig. While it is actually a rig and not technically a single baitfish image, the umbrella rig makes this list because of how effective it is. A great way to catch a ton is to fish an umbrella rig with some white curly tail grubs on each wire or some silver-colored shed swim baits. You can even attach spinning blades on a few of them if you choose. The result looks exactly like a school of swimming shad, which is what you want. The umbrella rig will readily accept many different kinds of soft plastic swim baits, curly tail grubs, jigs, or trailers. An umbrella rig consists of a weighted head with two or more wire arms that jet off the back and these have barrel snap swivels attached. You attach your minnows by snapping them onto the barrel swivels with the line ties. Your main line should be tied onto the front end of the weighted head. These particular rigs are regulated in some states, so it's important to know your local laws. Especially concerning the ones regarding how many minnows or hooks you can use, you can replace a number of either with spinning blades to keep you legal. Although many tournaments also ban the use of umbrella rigs too, some may allow it depending on the rules. Be familiar with the regulations always. The umbrella is exactly how it sounds. An umbrella from Yum. The umbrella has wire arms that will allow you to attach swim baits, curly tail grubs, and others while giving you the look of a swimming school of baitfish. We chose the umbrella because it is not expensive, easy to use, and can easily be modified to use spinner blades when requested. 
This particular one has three wire arms which are usually legal in most places. You can successfully copy a school of fleeing bait very easily without fear of a fine from the game warden. Moving on to the next at number 4 with Zoom Fat Albert Curly Tail Grub. One of the most popular attractors out there is a curly tail grub mounted onto a jig head. Anywhere from a 1 32nd ounces all the way to a 1 16th ounces jig head work well. The 1 16th size jig head is a good versatile jig head to use. Curly tail grubs are extremely effective producers, especially when retrieved at a slow to moderate speed over an actively feeding school. Solid white or silver and shed colors tend to work well. You can cast or retrieve them as well as use them for vertical jigging. You can rig a curly tail by taking one and threading it onto a jig head. Make sure the curly tail is facing upwards like the hook is. Curly tail grubs perfectly match fry or new hatchlings. Curly tails have a nice action on the retrieve. Cast it out and retrieve it at a moderate or slow speed, depending on the temperature. We seriously recommend giving the zoom grub a try. The action of the tail on the retrieve is just incredible. Not only is it enticing, but it is also durable. Zoom has been manufacturing quality tackle for a very long time, and just the name alone proves effectiveness. You can mount the Zoom grub on a jig head to appeal to every size of fish out there. The number 3 position is held by Rapala Shed Rap Deep Diving Round Bill Crankbait. Catching base with crankbaits is fun and efficient. They work well because they are reaction lures. You can use them for power fishing as well as casting and retrieving. When they are all schooled together chewing on shad, the crankbait is nice because it is erratic. You can trigger them into striking by making them react. Crankbaits are generally more effective in the cases of rising temperatures, although not always. Any predator that chases bait fish will bite a crankbait. Crankbaits can be used as search and find tools too. You can troll them behind your boat to cover a lot of water quickly. They also make hooking up easier because the targeted species have small mouths and having two trebles increases the hookup ratio. The key to fish any crankbait effectively is to choose the right color beforehand as well as the right depth of diving lip. We typically suggest a normal size, shallow diving, crank with a square bill, and a shad pattern for the best versatility. Troll them to find the fish or cast them as you see fit. A very easy decision, the best crankbait in our opinion, is the Rapala Shed Wrap. Aside from the obvious, the profile of this incredible crank is one that appeals to literally anything that likes to eat shad. Something unique about the Shad Wrap is that it has no rattle. This is a reaction profile with no sound to speak of. The presentation is realistic and effective. It's also the most popular. Next at number 2 we have Little Cleo Casting and Jigging Spoon. Regardless of whether you should choose a jigging spoon or a casting spoon, understand that a spoon of any kind can be a top producer. Because of their natural baitfish profile and action, they do a good job of imitating literally hundreds of species of baitfish. If you have a color that matches what the predators naturally feed on, you can easily fill up the stringer. Spoons are popular because they have been around a very long time and have one of the highest reputations of any artificial out there. In their simplest form, they are nothing more than an oddly shaped piece of metal with a hook on the end. Although it may sound basic, they have produced enough fish to be considered essential in the tackle box. Casting spoons are very easy to use. Just cast them out and reel it back in. If you have a jigging spoon, it is better to get on top of the school, drop it down, and jig it until they strike. This is also great for ice fishing when you need to sit at a hole and stay there. Of all spoons at our disposal, we have decided on the Little Cleo casting spoon. While they don't have a ton of bells and whistles, they do have one thing, and that is that they work. The Little Cleo works well as a casting or jigging spoon and can even be retrieved. This means you can have the versatility of three different spoon types, all without changing baits. Instead of taking three boxes, you can take only one and be all set to start fishing spoons. They come with a razor-sharp hook and are even regarded as one of the greatest lures of all time. 
Finally the number one position is dominated by Yum Lures Pulse Soft Plastic Paddle Tail Swim Bait. Don't ever be afraid to throw a swim bait if you are targeting any size of white base. Swim baits make a very real and effective presentation no matter where you throw them. Swim baits of both kinds can be especially productive. You can rig soft swim baits a few ways. Use swim baits with foiled out bodies and shed patterns for best results. Both hard and soft swim baits can be effective depending on the action you are trying to achieve. Soft swim baits give generally more options to consider than hard ones do, especially when fish are this size. Rig them weedless. You may also get a little more realistic action on soft swim baits. Either way, learning to fish swim baits is something that will help you out in the long run. They can be effective in literally every water temperature, as well as in every season of the year with absolutely no restrictions. You will often get some of the biggest catches on these too. We have found that the best swim bait for this species is the Yum Pulse Swim Bait. It has a very wide wobble pattern coupled with realistic paint jobs. It perfectly imitates a shad or minnow and is great on a Texas rig, swim bait hook, or as a trailer on something else. It also makes swim bait fishing easy. That's all for today. We upload product review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button for the upcoming video notification.